sit down beside me and stay a while Let our hearts do their part With wild words to me I just arrived in San Francisco Look who I found <laughs> What's up guys? Good morning. It is the first morning of our road trip. We're here for 10 days. I haven't really talked to you guys at all, but we flew into San Francisco yesterday, which you saw, and we're in Santa Rosa for a couple nights, and we're doing wine tasting today. So we just picked up a coffee, and we'll be on our way. This area is so stunning and peaceful. So excited to go to the different vineyards um, and pretend like I know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Hello guys, we got back from our walk, which was lovely and we made some breakfast. Sophia made us some scrambled eggs. Honestly, just such the move if you're staying at an Airbnb with a kitchen to just make breakfast at home obviously cheaper and easy and really nice and we had this beautiful view to enjoy this Airbnb is really cute it's a split home so that's the family's home and then this is the Airbnb I'm gonna leave the link for links for all the Airbnbs and everywhere that we're staying in the description so I feel like I have to blend in my makeup a little more. I'm also gonna do a little blog post of my itinerary when we're traveling. So if you guys are interested in doing something like this, you can use that. All credits to my cousin Eliza for planning this trip. She killed it. I kind of came in super last minute, so itinerary credits are all on her. But I am just really grateful to be here. I'm working on some stuff and I'm just getting really inspired by my surroundings and this trip. We have a designated driver today, so we're not drinking and driving. So he's gonna pick us up in about 45 minutes. So I'm just gonna get dressed and then probably just chill outside for a bit before we head to the first vineyard. I think we're going to three. So here's a little kitchen area and you walk outside. We have this nice table. We chilled here last night and had breakfast here. And look how sweet this view is. Who do we have here? Who do we have here? Hello, Miss Molly. If I owned Airbnb, I would require every Airbnb to come with a dog. Molly, I love you, I love you. I am wearing this romper that I've worn a million times, but I love it. That was easy. We just got to our first vineyard and it is beautiful. We got in, there's gardens. I'll give you guys a little tour. I'm so excited. I've never in my life gone right into red wine. Goodbye to our little Airbnb. It was so perfect. Goodbye, Airbnb. You were lovely. Guess who's driving? Good morning, 
guys. We left Santa Rosa this morning and we drove to Napa. We're stopping at a cafe that was recommended to us that is apparently Oprah's favorite. So we had to stop here. Napa is beautiful, so I'm just gonna vlog and show you guys around as we explore, but I'm really excited for this bakery. I get the strong dose along the west coast. Let me find out. Hello, guys. We made it to Truckee. It is so gorgeous. We just dropped our stuff off at the Airbnb, and now we're on. A gorgeous hike. This is, I think, the Truckee River Trail. I feel like I, the first two days I was here, I was like super caught up in, I don't know, just feeling my best because I was a little sniffly and just getting into the swing of it. And this past 24 hours, I've just felt so grateful and grounded and present. I'm really grateful for that because I feel like that mindset can kind of get away from me sometimes but i feel like i'm really internalizing that so i'm just really grateful Ten thousand miles away from a so cold This spot is so cute. You guys recommended it. I got an egg and cheese. I love those little signs. Well, outside of the world, she's really well. Oh my <laughs> god! Good morning, guys. Coming at you from Lake Tahoe. So beautiful. I feel like I was just dropped in a postcard. We're gonna go for a hike and we have our bathing suits. We can jump in and it's just so beautiful. We're in nature. I don't have to be whispering right now, but I feel like it's the, I don't know, <laughs> responsible thing to do because it's so peaceful here. Okay, I'm gonna shut up and just show you guys the views because it's unreal. We just got to Emerald Bay Beach, which is probably one of the more famous points in Tahoe. And we did it. We finished our hike and we actually parked near a beach. So swam in Lake Tahoe. So chilly and fresh. I love you, Lake Tahoe. You're beautiful. Oh, I can't do it. <laughs> I can't do it. 
Spark Social SF. It is so cool. There's putt putt golf. Really fun. So cute. I love it. So I think we're gonna go around and just pick our own. Lombard Street, which is famous for being an insanely curvy street, and we're going up it. I am so much older now. My brother is a soldier now. I can't see him in the hill top in the wind. Getting cocktails here. Accidentally came to a cocktail bar that I think is the home to a cult. <laughs> it's about the futurists, basically home to this society that a lot of celebrities are in, and it's like a non-profit designed this place. So crazy. I'm in the bathroom right now, and there's a one-way mirror. Because why would there not be? Anyways, this is crazy. We are going to Greens tonight, which is a vegan restaurant that is like supposed to be insane overlooking the water so i'm really excited this place is insane the drinks were amazing super cool atmosphere but definitely want to research this tonight i left my love in san francisco We drove to, we're driving down Highway 1 today. So gorgeous. Our first stop is in Carmel by the Sea, which is so charming. If you guys watch Big Little Lies, this whole area is kind of where it takes place. So just imagining that those storylines are going on around me as I'm walking around. So lovely. We went to this adorable coffee house. This is kind of the backyard of it. Just gorgeous. So I think I'm gonna get, I'm gonna see if they can do a London fog is lavender earl grey and steamed milk and it's all six of us so kaylee and sydney are swapping out tonight but for the day we have all six of us which is the only time that all of us are here so enjoying the day we're going to monterey next which is the specific town that big little lies were filmed in so i'm going to be geeking out we're obviously going to be playing the playlist when we're driving there of course <laughs> in Monterey and it's so cool and if you go through the back there's like a huge garden with tons of people doing work and just hanging out and then I just came behind one of the buildings and there's this huge winding garden and all of the buildings have a lot of history pretty cool man <laughs> all of the pain so much pride running through my veins Look at 
What's up guys? It's Thursday. We are back. We're going south again. Tonight we're doing camping. I'm so excited. I've never camped. I'm very excited. I've never, I don't think I've ever like properly camped, but we're camping on a beach and it's gonna be fun. We've been playing We're Not Really Strangers in the car and it's been a lot of fun. I just love the girls I'm traveling with and I feel really grateful. And it's like Eliza's friends, my cousin's friends, so I feel very grateful to be included and um, I don't know, I just, they're all really great and I love them. So we have about an hour and a half left. I've been driving. Yoikes. No, it's not. No, no. <laughs> no. I'm pretty sure that it's gonna end. No, it's not. <laughs> How can none of us? Oh, you're kind of right. I'm right. Oh. No, I was close. I had the right idea. That's an awful pig. <laughs> <laughs> <It's> like... <laughs> Just know that you may encounter wild animals including mountain lions, rattlesnakes, bobcats, coyote, bears, and ticks. Poison oak is prevalent. Most importantly, enjoy this beautiful trail. <laughs> What's up guys? Good morning. Let's just say I have a lot of respect for people who camp. I ended up sleeping in the car. I, I went in at like 4 a.m. because I had, I think, a rock in my back. We all survived. And now we are headed to Hot Springs. And then later today, we are headed to LA.
We're gonna get you to safety. We just stopped in beautiful Santa Barbara. We went to the Handlebar Cafe, recommended by Lucy Bassam. She went to school here. So I think we're gonna chill here, walk around Santa Barbara, it's beautiful, and then get on the road to LA. So we can do an early check-in. We're all just, we want a shower. <laughs> Cute little Los Angeles okay. hotel. that we've been wanting to go into. We got brunch this morning with my friend Eli. Yeah, I think we're gonna make our way back to the hotel, but we'll probably do Santa Monica later today. Yeah, my eyes, I've been watering all morning. Sydney just met the love of her life. She manifested meeting this person and quite literally bumped into him. Bought her a drink. I'm a little breathless. I'm well, we're at this beautiful waterfront Venice. We have our wine. I know. We just made our final stop to Air One. Had to come here. Actually, really good. But. Um, we're dropping off Wacky Wayne, and it's so sad. What was your guys' favorite part of the trip? Wayne. Wayne. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, so okay, my battery is dying, but we're headed to LAX, heading home. I'm going to New York, they're going to Boston. It's just so sad. Anyways, great trip. My camera's gonna die again. <laughs> no! <laughs> I feel like this this. It's a metaphor for how we all feel right now. <laughs> We're all tired. Pierre Gare, c'est la grande arme de la coquetterie. 